Yeah, you know, we just um, disappointing in, in the in the game. You know, I thought our guys did some good things. Um, you know, we got it to to two two. You know, I, I thought we we worked hard to get to two two there in the second, and then you know we gave it a goal right back at them, gave it to them within forty seconds, and you know for me that was a turning point right there. Then they got the the next goal, and we didn't manage the game well. The next shift after a goal is, uh, you know, we put an emphasis on it and making sure we have good details, and we had. You know, five times had the puck and didn't manage the puck well, and you know we end up it ends up in our net, and then they score shortly. I don't know how much longer after that, but a goal from the you know between the blue line and top of the circles, and uh, you know that, and we just hey we just need to be better. Um, you know, from our goaltender right through our defensive to our forwards, all, all everyone's got to be better. And when you're playing against a good team as Boston College is, you you, you know, and, and with good goaltending. You got to find a way to win a three-two game, and you know we got to two-two, and we thought we tightened up a little bit, but you know they've got the firepower, and and you know we we helped them out um, by just not managing the game well, and you know then they got two at the end, um, you know to make it six-two. So you know there's some things I thought we did well. Um, you know the score I don't think is indicative of, of the game. A loss is a loss, so that's all I'm looking at it. Um, but there's things that we can do better, and um, and then we'll get right back at it tomorrow. And get ready for Connecticut. Questions for Coach? Coach, um, yesterday you said that one of the things you were looking out for, especially coming back from the pause, was was your guys' legs and how well they responded and what their energy was. What did you see from them on that front tonight? Um, you know, I, I thought at times we, we, we had good energy and, you know, I, I don't know if the energy was a lack of uh, from being off, although, you know, we had two guys that went down you know, we lost our goaltender, you know, with cramps and dehydration. And we lost Josevic, you know, both, you know, six, seven minutes into the, or seven, eight minutes into the third period. So I don't know if that was a result of not being on the ice for a while, but it certainly shortened our bench and, you know, two key components, you know, to our team. So, um, but I thought, you know, our guys who logged a lot of minutes and Harris and Solo, and I thought they had good legs, um, but we'll just, you know, as I said, we'll just, we'll gotta just keep getting better. Anything else, guys? Uh, I'll go ahead. Yeah, uh, Coach, what is what is the latest on Connor? Is he going to be good to go? Uh, I don't know. He's being evaluated by the doctors. I, I believe so, but he's being evaluated by the doctors right now. Um, you know, there was we lost three players in the game. We lost him. We lost. I said Joseph, and then we lost Struble in the game too. So, um, you know, shorten the bench, but we'll we'll get I'll get a better feel for it uh, later on tonight, tomorrow morning. Updates on any of, of, of the uh, other guys at all? Um, you know, we're still, you know, Bushler and, and uh, Levi are still, they're making real good progress. Um, you know, Bushler's on the ice, um, you know, so he's working on his conditioning. Um, uh, they're still probably three weeks away, though. Sorry, just quick clarifier. You said you said Connor went down. It was it was dehydration and, and that kind of stuff. Was it the same for uh, for Joseph Eck and for um, Struble? Joseph Eck was the same. Struble was different. What was it for uh, for Struble? Lower body. Okay. Any more questions for coach? <clears throat> yeah, so would you, uh, <clears throat> what kind of a lineup do you anticipate for Friday night? Do you have, uh, you, will those guys be back? Uh, the, the guys that went out tonight? You know, I, I believe they, I mean, I, I believe two of them probably will. Like the guys who are dehydration and, and uh, um, you know, cramps, I think they'll be back. We've got, you know, we've got a few days here to get ready. Struble is going to be evaluated. And, um, so I, I mean, I'll know more on him tomorrow, but I anticipate the two guys, Andrew, who, uh, you know, Joseph and, and Murphy to be ready. You know, we've seen, and you, you've, you sort of alluded to this already, but we, we've seen how difficult it can be for, for teams coming back from a break, uh, facing a team that's been active. Uh, what, were you guys able to practice 
as a team during this or did you have to break up into small groups or how'd that work? Yeah, no, we got back at it, you know, a week ago, you know, yesterday, a week ago, Monday, we didn't have our full team. You know, we get, we had guys coming back as, as you know, time went, as a week went along, we got our full team back. We had four players rejoin us on Sunday for the first time, having been out for, you know, for 10 days. So, um, but yeah, that's not an excuse. I mean, we were, ready to go and we had enough practice time under our belt and at this point the guys just want to play games um you know and you know hey when you play bc is a quality opponent whenever you play them right so uh, this was a good test for us and um you know they're number one in the country and you know they're a very good team play the game fast great goaltending they're, they're strong in all phases and you know gives us a barometer we, we've got a ways to go still I, as i said i like some of the things we did but we got to learn how to manage games a lot better and uh and play smarter as, and we had some good looks uh, when it was four two. We had some good looks, and hey, the you know the goalie made some good saves. And then we didn't. There was times we didn't execute around the net well enough. Um, and it was some of our skill guys. We got to execute a lot better. So, um, you know, the game under our belt will be good and help us get ready for uh, you know for Friday night against a very good UConn team. Given the the calendar, where what day it is today? Is it kind of weird that this one wasn't yesterday inside TD Garden? Yeah, no, you're absolutely right. Um, it's, uh, <laughs> you know, I think we all wish we were down in the garden yesterday. And uh, it seems like we have more success against BC in the garden than any of the buildings that we play them in, you know? Um, so, uh, but yeah, no, it was weird not not playing them uh, yesterday and, um, and not playing the beanpot. Saying that, hey, we just want to play. And, you know, and, you know, whether it be tonight, whether it be Friday, uh, regardless of who the opponent is, I think all of us in the league are just, you know, just want to play games and, and, and you know, and so we'll get ready for Friday.